Hello and welcome to Horror at Monster Collectibles where today we are going to be taking a look at the brand new NECA Trick or Treat Sam Head Knocker. Now this is a resin statue. Uh, it's hand painted and um, it's obviously from their Head Knocker series and it comes in at about $40. Um, but it is about 7 inches tall and about 5 inches wide and uh, I'm excited to take a look at it. So let's go ahead and spin this around and take a closer look. All right, so here he is out of the packaging. Uh, he just has a foam packaging. Let's go ahead and take a look at this dude. Look at the detail in the paint job on here. It looks fantastic. Going back through here. Now there is some bleed over on the orange onto the rock. It looks like it needs to be cleaned up a little bit. It wouldn't be too bad to clean up on your own, but ideally it wouldn't be there in the first place. But at $40, I mean, this thing is freaking badass. Let's go up here. So, Sam's head sculpt. And obviously this is a stylized version of him. A larger head so he can kind of bobble around there. But man, he is freaking badass. And again, just really, really good detailing down on here. He looks so well done. All right, guys. So that's about all there is to go over on this Sam Headknockers. I think it's badass. Um... I was a little bit scared off at first about the $40 price, uh, but seeing it in hand, um, I think it's actually like a great deal. Uh, it's a quality resin piece that's gonna last forever. Um, the sculpt is great, the texture is great, the color choices are great, the paint job is great. With the note that I have that little bit of bleed over, um, from the orange suit onto the rock, but that's easily fixable, but I'm just dinging it because ideally it wouldn't be there But at this price point at this day and age This is a great value at $40. Uh, it's got good size. It's got good presence um, Again at seven inches tall and over five inches wide um, It looks badass uh, It's a great size. Uh, it doesn't get lost in the collection, but it's not too big where it's hard to display um, it would really look good on anybody's um, shelf or, or some, somebody's desk at work or whatever. Uh, this thing is super dope, and I highly recommend these guys. I know stylized figures aren't for everybody, um, but I've warmed up to these um, bobbleheads, and uh, I have their um, Billy from Saul, uh, which is a great piece as well. Uh, but I think this guy is probably my favorite. Um, but yeah, like I totally recommend uh, this NECA piece. Um, it's fantastic. And honestly, NECA has been killing it, just absolutely murdering everybody else for years now. Uh, I wish that McFarlane would step back up to the form that they once were. Um, I know that they lost a bunch of guys to NECA, and I don't think they ever recovered from that, and that's just a shame. But at least NECA is giving us fans stuff that we we love. I mean, licenses licenses that they have have been great, and then over the past couple of years, their head sculpts have been just fantastic. Uh, you know, what we're getting for, you know, $30, $35 figures is pretty phenomenal at, in today's like inflation, crazy inflation times. So as always, feel free to leave any questions or comments and I'll be happy to answer them. I will leave you with a 360 video spin of this dude. And as always as well, feel free to like and subscribe and click the bell for notifications for new videos. And until next time, I will see you guys later.